What's up guys? So in this video, I'm gonna be talking about what I think are the best investments that you can make in your life. It doesn't matter if you're 18, 25, or 65. So the first thing we have to address is what an investment is. Most people view investment as a monetary investment. So invest a dollar into a business, an asset, a stock, and real estate, and you're looking for increase in value of that asset. So let's say you invest in a dollar, increases a two, you sell it for three, your arbitrage is $2, okay? So that's how most people view investment. However, like anything in life, before, before you invest in either real estate or stocks or angel investor or whatever platform you focus on, you have to become a master of yourself. And this is why I believe the greatest investment ever is an investment in yourself. Warren Buffett said it. The best investment he ever did was learning public speaking. He took a course for 500 bucks and he credits that $500 course to making billions and billions of dollars. See, when it comes to maximizing human capital, okay, so that's you and I, so maximizing human capital, it's maximizing meta learning in an individual. Regardless if you now wanna to go to stocks or if you wanna to go to real estate or if you wanna go angel investing or if you wanna go like Forex or currency or crypto, it really doesn't matter. At the end of the day, the commonality among all of those is you as a human being. What is your intellectual level? What is your empathetical level? Uh, what is your meta learning? So how can you learn something, relearn it or unlearn it then relearn something new so you can apply that to a new model. Most people, why they lose money in any form of investment is they go in blindly. For example, myself, I don't really invest in stocks because to be honest, I don't understand them. I don't have the time right now to investigate certain stocks, uh, nor do I want to spend my money since I don't understand it. And see, this is why you hear people lose shit ton of them, they lose their savings, they lose their, uh, you know, RRSPs here in Canada, your retirement savings plan. And the reason why people lose money is because they have no idea what they're doing. They just blindly put in money. As opposed to when I say invest in yourself, I want you to become a better human being. I want you to understand empathy. I want you to invest in learning, not just learning a new skill, but in the actual love of learning itself. So that's a meta power, and I've said it this before, I think the most powerful thing you can do in your life is to double down on meta learning. So for example, let's say, so let's say you have, um, I don't know, you're, you're interested in investing in stocks, okay? What you wanna do is you wanna get the best books in stocks, you wanna try to get the best people on the phone in stocks, and you wanna see patterns on what they did, because most people, they try to reinvent the wheel. It's not about reinventing the wheel, it's about, looking at models and patterns that already happened before. Ray Dalio talks about this. He runs the biggest uh, hedge fund in the world, uh, Bridgewater. So you can look up his amazing PDF called Principles. You can just Google principles.pdf and download it, do it. It's an in-depth exercise on part two. It takes you a while, but I highly recommend that you do it. So when you are uh, looking up these stock people, stock books and studying, you wanna look for commonalities. And the whole idea of meta learning is you wanna to try to absorb information and get to the root cause. What are the key things that actually make a person successful? Just like any book, 90% is fluff and about maybe 10% is actually the nitty gritty, the most important things possible. So if I'm looking at everything, whether it's going into stocks or whether it's cryptocurrency, and I'll give a real life example, you know, investing in cryptocurrency for me is fairly new in the last year and a half, like actually investing and going in deep and trading, etc. I talked to the best people, uh, I viewed the patterns, I looked at successful people, and I didn't reinvent the wheel, and I dived in deep, I understood the principle. I did another video talking about, you know, becoming smarter and learning the basic principles and what are the principles of that set topic. I learned those principles first, and then anything I learned new was based off of those principles. And, you know, the rest is history. So, the best investment you can do in your life, doesn't matter if you're 18, doesn't matter if you're 25, doesn't matter if you're 66, is start investing in yourself. Man. There's there's a Greek saying, or it can, it doesn't have to be Greek. Whoever said this is a smart person. It's your job to go to bed smarter than when you woke up. Most people go to bed dumber than when they woke up. Social media, bullshit, of, what are you guys doing? Fucking absorbing information on fucking shit. As opposed to like, what are you doing today to better yourself? You know, um, did you learn something today? Did you train your body today? Um, did you apply a new task today? And that's how you become better. Forget about all these gimmicks. I think, I think uh, investing in something that you have no fucking idea whatsoever, that's just gonna equal out to disaster. And that's exactly what is happening 
to every motherfucker who invests in something that has no idea what he or she is doing, okay? And that's that. Spend time on yourself. As Rumi says, yesterday I was clever, I wanna change the world, today I'm wise, I wanna change myself. And you're gonna be light years ahead of everybody else. And oh yeah, don't forget to leave a comment. Type that below, subscribe, you know, there's a button somewhere, not on the screen, but somewhere on YouTube. YouTube keeps on changing. And share this, peace.